Hey there, everyone. This is Alcal playing uh, VIP6. And uh, so, in case you haven't been following um, the Talk House or uh, my Patreon uh, Discord server, uh, oof, wow, way to go, Alcal. I've decided that after this video, I just, I just want, I just want my lives, man. All right, I don't know. <laughs> this is a good start. So basically, this game is entering nightmare mode. Like from now on, from what I've heard, there are no more lets like Ninji Park and stuff. It's just full on nightmare, 100% of the time. That might have a time. Like I want to make sure that I give myself the time to play these levels correctly and whatnot. There we go. Now it's automated. And so I think it's best to just like to be able to just focus on it. I'm returning on three videos a day. Uh, because I've started VLDCX first, I'm gonna finish that first. And once I'm done, we're gonna be returning to the end game of VIP6. I know some people are like, well, you should do it the other way around. And I know why you're saying that. It's because the VIPs are genuinely pretty interesting to watch. But, for one part, like, I start with VLDCX first, and also, like, I believe it- Whoa, I got BO lives. How have I managed to do that? Um, okay. <laughs> Bad odor. Uh, but also, like, it's just that, uh, you know, I want- I like leaving the best for last. Anyways, can I fly? I don't know, ma'am. Okay, back 99. Can I fly? Well, I can maybe fly here and see if there's anything cool here. Huh? How about that? Did you think? Yeah! Look at this big, massive tree. There's nothing to learn here. I expect, basically, from now on, to just warp to a strange new place suddenly. Birds are your friends! Yeah! They'll carry you on their backs. The wind is very strong here, so mind your footing. Whoa! So, uh... I don't know if you've noticed how Boone didn't move at all, uh, there for a hot second. Uh, yeah, uh, I think there's a powerful wind behind my back at some point. At some point you hit some kind of threshold. Or is it just when you jump? No. Yeah, at this bush. Look at that. Okay, I can still fight it. Oh, this just makes it weirder. This is not what I thought. Well, there's that bird. Uh, here's a star. Do I want the star? Like, I actually legitimately do not know. Uh, well, that was a dumb move on my end. Bird. Okay, so the birds are solid. They're probably albatrosses. Resprite as green birds with a basket. As you do. Beef fruit's gonna bask this. Do I, uh, skulls? Sure. I'm playing pit hat now. All right, this guy has got the mahjong. Finally. Oh boy, it's wind. It is wind. This is windy. Welcome to the wind. I want to bop this platform in case there's something cool. I mean, if as long as the wind is constant, as long as I miss it completely, constantly. Oh, not for mushroom. Yeah. That's exactly why I tried for many a night a day. Ugh. All right, I guess we do that. Go! All right. I got a shell. Jump! Fell off! <laughs> guess I didn't jump ahead of time enough, fast enough, enough. Okay, so, I mean, this is not at all what I expected the level to be about, but it's there. High bullet, uh, high bullet, high bullet. Uh, well, I missed out there. I messed it up. There's probably stuff. I'm one up. Okay. So clearly they're. Ugh, I don't think. Maybe if I got P speed? Just barely. But like, why? What could be here? Yeah, no, yeah. This is part of the extended Dagadon challenge. Well, I've touched it. I'm happy. I can now live. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is about as uncomfortable as it looks like, but that's that's the only thing though. It is as of yet merrily uncomfortable, not like maddening. I. It's just what's in business these days. Oh, so now I'm stuck here. 
Can't even touch the moon, because I'm small. Alright! Oh, yeah. Hmm. Mind fresh and it's pretty... It's pretty okay. Oh, another mushroom? I'll miss it. I will miss it completely. Okay... That could've gone bad. Alright, so I don't know... Anything. Really? About anything. Okay, so jump early there. Okay, well... Ugh! There is a jump! Press the jump button, but I must have pressed it too late. Wild. So wacky. I... I don't understand that. You go through a pipe to go out of a Mario 3 pipe on the other side, and then you touch an invisible warp. That's kind of awkward. I just, I just don't get it. Go. I'll take that one up. There's also plenty of coins in the level. Uh, okay, here we go. Your hitboxes are so generous, little green bird. And I appreciate that greatly. I mean, I can, but like, I'm gonna be running at full speed. Yeah, like, I wouldn't be able to catch it. Like, even if I wanted to. And like, if I die here, it's 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 going to be falling down a pit. So like, what what ifs? Uh, wow! So you have to do that that way? All skill? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> so so you have to keep your. Wow, your shell to dis- Wow, you know what? It's all good. Hey, fireball! Or mushroom in the future, probably. When I inevitably die. Not stand. So the wind here now goes against me? Oh, shoot. Like, I'm trying to demonstrate this, but like, see, look, see? Boo's not moving. He's just sliding on his heels. He's not wearing heelies. The wind is just that strong. Oh, and here the slowdown. Is that real? Okay, so uh, the was I supposed to jump? Oh, okay, you are supposed to jump on that bird, but I don't know. I don't know that bird was coming to town. This is uh, this is some thing. Yeah, this is some interactions that's happening. E e o e o. Then you did jump. It is the joy of diagonals. Yeah, there are knolls in these hills. Oh, check out the sweet little reset room there. Again! Making you go through a like I'm I'm like I'm sure there's a reason for it. I do not deny that. But I wonder what set reason is. Like it's just so strange to me. Alright, so oh boy, yeah. I think it's that carousel over here. It's just like it's just a little bit too much. For the little fake endo. Alright, yeah, yeah, there we go. Thank you for your basket. Again, I press the jump, but I think what's happening is if I'm pressing left while the hill is slanting left and I hold left and the wind's blowing leftward, I think what happens is that my player character just with all of these going on, just stop standing on anything. Uh, making it hard to jump. Well, here I was able to do it, but there wasn't any wind yet. Ah, dude! Well, whatever, I'm probably just gonna fall in this hole. It's fine. I'd be dead, please. I want to do science. See here, if I'm holding right, it's fine. If I'm holding left, he does not jump. If I'm holding left, he just flat out does not jump. So, uh... Keep that in mind. So I'm gonna need to like jump straight up and then hold left or something like that. Yeah. But then you're here and you're like, well, what's going on now? Birds? Okay. So, okay, so you bounce on that spring down there if you want the Dagadon. Because of the wind, you gotta keep stepping. Like, that's just, this is, this is, this is, that's, that's, that's just, that is just. Justice, that's how it looks like. Weird. 
I don't know what's going on anymore. We're in a new section today. That guy is just wobbling around, okay? I wanted to go low in this little. Oh boy, okay, so. Sweet. So, as you can tell, maybe the wind was blowing right. Yeah, fluids. They're useful. Yeah, don't don't do that. Like I know it looks safer, but if a hundred percent of the time I've done this, I want to get hurt. So don't do that. Also, I don't sure what you do if you miss your ride here. I don't know if like is it like a global sprite that's just always doing its thing. The animation of the wings is actually very lovely. Like, there's some, there's some love that went into that sprite. I don't know if it's from anything, or if it's, like, custom-made. I literally do not know. Alright, so here, yeah. Can you hear the wind blow? I can. It's in my back. Yeah. I mean, strictly speaking, when the wind is in your back like that, like, that's actually fun. Like, it's fun to be drawn forward. And, you know, making, like, huge jumps and stuff. What's... It's when it's in your... It's in your front that it's less fun. When it's a resistance. Once you press the P-switch, run like the wind! Wonder what'll happen if you feed the Yoshi. Oh. I don't know, man. So I'm probably too late. Okay, well, here we go. Whoa! Why? <laughs> I should have let go once I was over the floor. I didn't know what was happening. I never saw that happen. Well, I mean, it's obvious what happened. Dude was testing out with the wind, and then that happens. Like, what? That's funny. And then this segment existed. <laughs> like, in my... Like, I didn't know if it would just continue forever. So you just continued forever, and like, that was the end of the level. But no. Turns out it does expire. So you gotta, like... Stop it. Uh, okay. No, and there I... My crime was pressing left on that hill. You don't do that, because you can't jump. <sighs> the audience can see all the platforms. They see how all the things move and interact together. I'm going to land on this guy, but I'm only going to land on the one. I almost dropped you right in a pit. That would have been fun. Alright, so... I guess I wasn't at P-Speed, so it all broke apart. Hey, oh, jeez. Well, uh, that's gonna make it interesting. Shoot, see, last time, uh, I'm not gonna make it. I made it. Huh. Oh, I missed the th So, is this a don't get power up? Child, now I'm a little confused by what is being presented to me. Like, that's not a cool way to die. It's a fart way to die. It's just like, oh, yeah, what? Well, yeah. This is my type of jam. Alright. Yoshi! Hey! Oh, I got the mushroom. So, like, does this matter? Yes, you need Baby Yoshi here. All right. So it is a uh, Don. Okay. <laughs> I was wondering about that. Okay, so, I mean, I thought I tried it to just absorb the apples. Uh... I mean, maybe if I turn at the la- instead of riding the whole thing backward, maybe if I... If I, uh, turn at the last second... But I don't know if that'd be harder than trying to time jumps and stuff. Oh. 
Okay, so I I just wanted to know if bird was fireproof. It is not. <laughs> wow! So I did a, the extra tight part, I guess, where you go through to death and get a moon. What a wonderfully weird level. Here's a teapot. You know, for fun. As something to remember this level by. What a wild and nutty level. Um... It's kind of unfortunate that it ends with, like, you know, instant death, the uh, Hollapalooza at the end. But at the same time, like, clearly you can do it okay blind, like, on first read. So, it's not, I know, it looks hard. But it's actually maybe a little bit easier than you might think. This, I was afraid with the name, but in the end, I had a blast. So, yeah, to repeat myself from the end, uh, from the start of the video, this is gonna be on pause for like maybe like a month or so. I'm gonna finish VLDCX and then we're gonna return here and start World 7, the end game proper. I know it's a bit awkward, but uh, I got I had a choice to make. <laughs>